Well, Kutztown University students are getting into the game without stepping foot onto a court or a field. Instead, they are putting on their headsets and turning on their PCs to compete in their new eSports arena. Jim Vassell has the story. Kutztown University President Ken Hawkinson remembers when the only video game you could play was Pong. And then gradually I moved up to Space Invaders and even Pac-Man. Right. He and the university are moving way beyond a white dot bouncing on a screen. They're going wherever their new eSports arena will take them. You're going to die if I'm going to try to throw dynamite to back you up. Years in the making, the university opened its state-of-the-art $250,000 gaming arena on campus. It's kind of like having a wedding and planning for it for so long, and all of a sudden it's here and it's over. eSports has swept the nation and has grown a presence locally. Albright College in Reading has made eSports a varsity sport. And in Philadelphia, Comcast Spectacor is building a $50 million eSports sports arena. For today to happen is uh, surreal to me. The university made it a point to give these competitors the best of the best. Take for example these monster Lenovo computers. They are liquid cooled, much like a car. And speaking of cars, these bolstered seats feel like they're straight out of a Porsche. This is completely above any standards that I have had thought. KU eSports president and founder Connor Ellis says one day everyone will turn on to eSports. And with that comes scholarships and inviting people to come to Kutztown to play for um, their academic career. Jim Vassell, 69 News.